Parisa, before that, there's something very important we need to address. Um, in the course of the protest, the police officer, very senior police officer who stopped us with his policemen, said the speaker on the Rubajabi Amila asked that they should stop us. And the man put a call directly to the speaker. I am saying this because the speaker actually occupies a very sensitive and important position in this country. Yes, sir. That right honorable Femi Bajabi Amila could ask that the police officers should stop oh, that's, us. Oh, that's the police. Of the Order them to stop us from getting to the National Assembly is disappointing. And we want to say this, that this is a huge disappointment on the spot. And there's a need for him to apologize to the Nigerian people. Mm -hmm. Nigerians were protesting the peacefully. The police officer? He was the... Is, 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 is he a, a man? Or Igwe, 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 Ben, Igwe, Ben, Igwe, Ben, Igwe, was standing on behalf of the Commissioner of Police. It's a DCP operation, FCT. The speaker called him in our presence and he said that flush them away. We are going to hold the speaker accountable for this. Beyond this administration, Femi Bajabi Amila, we give explanation for this nonsense. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. And to ask what has been said. It's so sad that the Nigerian police force, whom we the taxpayers are the ones that pay their salary, would have the temerity to try and stop a protest of the Nigerian people. Nigerian youths were killed at Lake Toll Gates on 10-20-2020. Till today, no officer has been arrested for this egregious atrocity. And just today, when we try to draw the world's attention to this particular horrendous crime against the Nigerian people, the Nigerian wing of the political class, the, sorry, the military wing of the political class, tried to stop us. Well, the people united, as we say, can never be defeated. We had and we achieved more success than we thought we even set out to achieve. I will meet again by five. I will meet again by five o'clock for the cardinal. Let me also add that a rebellion is coming. That nobody will be able to stop. No one can add that to stop. The police will see it and run away. The army will see it and abandon their weapons. Or they will have no option than to join us. No. So, thank you everyone. And this statement has its roots in the constitution which proclaims that the true surveying are the people of Nigeria from whom government through this constitution derives all its powers and authorities. So the people surveying, the people who are the true surveying, once we say enough is enough.